While addressing producers, processors, and marketers in cassava, palm oil, rice, and maize value chains, Commissioner Mbanefo said the plan will help to ensure the adoption of the best international practices in food storage and preservation. He stated the need to train these major players so they could be able to record the kind of successes registered by vegetable farmers in the state. Mr. Mbanefo stated that the meeting is to ensure the standardization of all agricultural produce in the state to make it safe on Dan and Brown for export. He therefore urged the farmers to ensure that they use only chemicals that were certified by the ministry in their farms or for preservation. <laughs> I try I have all the best out of out of if I name it. And so if one the best would also mean that you will be able to produce it, process it, market it, going through the right processes. Then we can with the product to the full standard actually both for internal market and for external market. The acting director of the produce department of the ministry, Mrs. Uzamaka Emma Agwale, while noting the dangers of using unapproved chemicals in the preservation of farm produce, said the department will soon swing into action to monitor all the points of sale of agricultural produce to ensure that sanity is entrenched in the system. Today, like, we now find out that we are not taking the So, we are planning to go into the sensation of the two churches, the media houses, and the tambourines. At least to tell you, we are affecting what they are doing. Then we are now planning to hold another meeting to tell them the right chemicals to use to preserve their solids. Some of the participants at the meeting, Elder Christopher Wonsu, a cassava miller in Oka, Mrs. Veronica Okoe, a palm oil processor from Ihiala, and Mr. Nemeko Obiefuna, a rice processor from Ubuenu, Oka North local government area, called on the state government to set up a standard milling and processing machine for small and medium scale processors across the three senatorial zones in the state and the establishment of palm plantations as a way to encourage palm produce in the state. In Oka, I am David Obokwasi reporting for ABS News.